Hello everybody, welcome back to the world of me. My name is Cougar and this is another episode from our camping and survival series. Uh, now we've got a new product in today and this was something we kind of came across, thought it was going to be pretty nice for uh, you know, going out, doing camping, or even just doing it at home. But this is the uh, barbecue grill mat. Now, uh, of course, when you're out there grilling on the barbecue and everything, you've got all the openings there that uh, between the rails and everything. It does let the uh, flames up through and everything to get that uh, char grilled kind of kind of look and uh, taste and flavor. Uh, but sometimes there's things that uh, you may want to cook that. Uh, don't quite fit on the grill very well. Uh, they may fall through, uh, something like that, but you still want to uh, grill out on the barbecue, or especially if you're out there uh, camping or something like that, you don't necessarily have a, uh, a stove or a pan or something like that to cook in. Uh, so what you can do is uh, get one of these. Now this does come in as a two pack, and as you can see, it is a basic, just simple basic mat. Now the size of these, uh, they, they go by actual metric system and uh, here it says that they are, uh, they're 0.2 millimeters thick. So, so very, very thin of course. Uh, and then uh, they are 40 millimeters by uh, 33 millimeters. All you do here with these is just lay it on your grill. These do have a non-stick coating to them and uh, they will lay on top. Then you can take things like, heck, a, some eggs or something like that. Throw these on uh, top of the mat here after it's had a little chance to heat up and uh, you can actually cook eggs on these. Now these will conform a little bit to the grill so you could actually have grill lines on your eggs which is actually kind of interesting look to think about uh, but also something too is uh, if you go to maybe uh, flip it over with a spatula or something like that and there are those little grooves it's something that you might want to think about but since it's non-stick there's also that opportunity where if you have maybe a, a, a cooking glove or something like that and you have the eggs on one side you can flip it over and uh, set it over on the other side so that it'll it'll stay and cook and uh, you don't have to use any kind of utensils to kind of flip it around you could of course sit there and maybe move things back and forth uh, those are some different uh, techniques. I know when they use soft cutting boards, uh, they of course pick them up and use them to scrape out that way and channel everything in. And you can do something similar like that with these. Now of course these will be very hot, so that's why I say that you do need something like cooking gloves or something like that to do that with. But uh, they are a simple um, water and uh, light soap wash. Uh, you basically are just supposed to wipe them down or wash them off. Uh, right after you're done while they're still fairly warm of course be careful don't burn yourself uh, but since they are non-stick it kind of works like a um, cast iron pan you don't sit there and put it under soap and water and in the sink and scrub it down or anything like that you just while it's hot use a uh, simple towel or something like that with some water on it you wipe it out and everything comes off clean of course, with the heat, that will kill any of the bacteria or anything that's on it when you go to use it again, if there happens to be anything left over, which uh, in general there shouldn't be. I've seen these in various places. Uh, if you guys want to check out where I got it, you can go down there in the description below. Uh, we'll, of course, have a link there. While you're down there, don't forget to check out our social media. Leave a couple comments. Have you guys grilled with these? What do you like about them? What don't you like about them? And uh, also, don't forget to leave a thumbs up. Well, you know, do that on your way down or on your way back up. As well, if you haven't done it already, go ahead and hit those subscribe buttons. There'll be that little icon over here, or you can hit the button down there below the video. As well, don't forget to hit that bell icon so you're notified when we got new videos coming out here on World of Me. All right, guys, that'll do it for me today. Uh, this, of course, is part of our camping and survival series. All right, guys, well, I'd like to wish you all a good day. And I will see you later. Bye.